Hello everyone, I am Professor H.R. Ayer. In this video, we are going to see one of the special forming process that is a high energy rate forming process by explosive forming. First, we will see the special forming process. The special forming process, which is a non-conventional forming process, are new methods developed for modification of conventional methods or by the application of new technologies in that. Now these methods bring about many advantages comparing the conventional process. Next is high energy rate forming process. The parts are formed at a very rapid rate as a large amount of energy is applied to form a component for a very short interval of time and thus these processes are called as a high energy rate forming process. Explosive forming first introduced in 1960s for aeroplane industries. In this process, a workpiece and a die are placed in a working medium. The explosive is initiated at some distance to the workpiece resulting in initiation of the shock waves that travel through the working medium before accelerating the workpiece. In this technique, explosive charge is placed in a water medium at a definite standoff distance from the workpiece as shown. The work is supported on the die. A shock wave of very high intensity is produced when detonation of explosive charge takes place. This generates shock waves when impedance against the work the metal with the high velocity is deformed into the die. However, maintaining the vacuum in the die is necessary for this process to prevent adiabatic heating of the work and hence oxidation or melting. Next is advantages. First is to reduce the spring back effect which directly applies the accuracy of the product. Second is the large and thick parts can be easily deformed as the large bulky or higher thickness objects can be deformed with the help of this process. Next, the most water is used as a medium for energy transfer that is uniformly transferred throughout the system. And last one, the tooling cost is reduced as only one die is required for the process. Then disadvantages. First, as per the norms of the regulation of the government, explosive must be carefully handled. Next, this process is not suitable for the forming for a small and thin workpiece. Vacuum is necessary, which is at the extra cost, and the die which is used should be withstand at the high shock wave power. Applications now, explosive formed heat exchangers, computer shapes, gas mixtures for all gas turbines and complex profile. These are the various components can be manufactured with the help of explosive forming process. Thank you. Thanks for watching.